during the 4th of July, it's easy to focus on the fireworks, but they're not for everyone, including your pets. WBUA 23's Yostina Banoob joins us now. And Yostina, pets and fireworks are not the best combination. That's right, Tamika. I spoke with local veterinarian who say after the holidays, they see pets come in with injuries due to fireworks, such as burns. But there are simple ways to keep your pets safe and have fun. Many people love fireworks, but your furry friends may not. Veterinarian Robert Collins recommends you keep your pets indoor, in a secluded part of the house. I would have them on an inner room if you can, um, one that doesn't have a low standing window where you know if they hear the loud noise they may get spooked and try to jump through it. I have seen some that come in with lacerations from getting scared and jumping through a window or jumping through a glass door. But let's face it, not all pets are indoor friendly. So if you're outside, Colin says keep them close. He says the number of missing dogs increased during the 4th of July holiday. It's good to have them you know, a safe distance from the fireworks. You want to have them close to you, have a hold of them, you know, with a leash. It's good to have a, make sure you have an ID tag so just in case they do get away, they can be easily identified. Pet owner Aaron Christian says they normally keep their 16-year-old Maltese on a leash. But when they're watching fireworks downtown... We basically hold her in our lap and that keeps her safe and she, she doesn't seem to react about fireworks. And if you have an anxious dog, Collins says some herbal remedies such as melatonin may help or you can call your veterinarian for medication. If you know they're going to be nervous, it's good to go ahead and get that medication. And if you have, you know, a set time that you're going to be doing fireworks, to go ahead and give that, you know, an hour or two before you start to let it take effect, let them get calm and rather than right before you start or after you start and they're already nervous. Now, if you do take your pets to watch fireworks or you just have them outside with you, be cautious of their ears. Dr. Collins also says, like any humans, loud noise can damage their hearing. Reporting live in the studio, Yosina Banup, WVUA News.